Are you hungry, Elsa? Yes, I am quite hungry. How was your day? It was good. I was craving a good cob salad the whole day. So I'm going to make some for myself. Do you want it? Hmm, I haven't eaten vegan cob salad. I might as well try some of yours. But for lunch, I really want some lamb chops. You know, we all our lives have heard that meat is good for health, and there is so much debate about it. We have so many people lean, sharp, and shredded who are on this diet, and they look healthy apparently. Good health is best defined by your personal goals. You have a keen interest in learning the best way to build long-term health in a way that slows down the aging process and maybe in the near future even reverses the aging process and cure most diseases. What's the best way to do that? For the sake of our health, especially as it relates to longevity, if we're given the option between plant-based or animal-based food, we must choose plant-based food. I think I know what you're referring to. Do you mean we must choose the food that contains the plants that have faced adverse conditions in their life? Yes, they have some molecules that are released in the time of stress, and these molecules, when we intake these plants, help us in our defensive system against diseases and help us remain healthy. These molecules are NAD boosters, and kind of an important one is resveratrol. I know that it's also found in the grapevines like the one in your garden. Not only in that, but also grapes, wine, grape juice, peanuts, cocoa, and berries of vaccinium species, including blueberries, bilberries, and cranberries. The thing I want to tell you is that we've seen people debate about how a meat-based diet has helped them and how effective that is, but this is just the experience of 5 or 10 or 15 years. It might not be good for the plan of 50 to 60 years. If your goal is to achieve age 100, the science is conclusive. Intermittent fasting along with a plant-based or even a Mediterranean diet is best for reverse aging your life. Some scientists believe that it is possible to live to age 150 even though currently 120 years seems to be the longest life possible so far. So how can we fulfill our need for resveratrol? Just like we take our multivitamins daily in the form of supplements. And if we have it, shouldn't we eat meat? The thing is, if I want to bulk up and gain my strength muscularly, I might as well go on a meat diet for a year and go back to do what I was doing or may want to go back and forth to be healthy, fit and young. Like in the clinical trials, if the resveratrol was given to the mice, it didn't impact the lifespan extension of mice. But if the mice were given every other day, um they didn't statistically live longer unless they had some other adversity, which in that case was a high fat diet. and their resveratrol worked really well to protect them and they lived longer. Wow. How will it impact human's life and how should we take it? That I'll tell you tomorrow at breakfast. Why not now? Because it's a surprise. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe and get notified.